I'm not religious. And some people are very religious. And that's fine if people are religious, but it seems like the people that are religious are way more into getting me to be into religion than I am into getting them out of religion. <laughs> Which is annoying. I hate that. And I only tell you that I'm not religious because it's my show and I can say what I want. I would never come to your house. Hey, what's up? I don't believe in the shit you believe in. All right, I'm out of here. <laughs> it's on your Saturday. You got a beautiful family. Let me knock this Bible off. Peace out. I don't know why you got a Bible right at your front door anyway, whatever. That's rude to just yell your stuff at people when they didn't ask. Some people write me. I get, I get messages online all the time about my beliefs. This woman wrote me this message. I want to share with you this message that she wrote me on my Facebook fan page. She wrote this. And also, you know, when you write something crazy on the internet, you're supposed to write it, and then you're supposed to step back, let that shit breathe a little bit, and you come back, oh, I was being crazy. And you just let it go, you erase it. But she wrote this crazy. She said, I saw your show in Phoenix, and my heart went out to you. I want to assure you that there is a God. There's only one God who loves you so much that he gave his only begotten son to save us. Well, you know what? God sounds like kind of a shitty father to me. <laughs> if God is so powerful, why do he have to give his son up? Sounds like God owed somebody some money and they couldn't get to him, so they murked up his son. And that's what I really think happened. Jesus got stabbed up in the alley, but it's easier to sell crucifix, so they, they <laughs> it's easier to sell this shit than it is to sell that right there. You can't sell a pendant of somebody getting shanked up in the alley. It's a marketing scheme. My version is really weird, but so is a lot of shit in the Bible. You telling me two of every animal in one boat? Get the fuck out of here, please. <laughs> Jesus was born, died, and rose again, defeating Satan. Well, if Satan is defeated, then what the fuck are you messaging me for right now? <laughs> no, I think Satan is alive and well because he empowered you to write this bullshit on my Facebook page, you condescending bitch. <laughs> Believe it and trust it in him. We will get to spend eternity with him in heaven. We will all spend eternity somewhere. I now pray for you every day and hope that you find your way to Jesus. And I replied, so you trying to get the dick or what? Cause <laughs> it sounded like she was trying to get the dick, but she covering it up with all that Jesus stuff. Like, if you want to come through, come through, but let's be adults about it. <laughs>